ready start a very eventful year has just passed the common man has reaffirmed his belief in democratic values and restored our distinction as the largest living democracy in the world on this occasion each one of us has to ask ourselves in all humility whether we have followed the inspiring example set by the leaders of this ancient land have we comprehended the new national ethos and adequately responded to it in this context it is disappointing that the professional classes as well as business and industry have not shown sufficient evidence of their being prepared to accept their share of national responsibility the future is unfolding itself what are our immediate preoccupations and aspirations for the future the coming elections to the state assemblies afford an occasion for all political parties to prove their dedication to democracy and cleanliness in public life but as reported is not the result but how it is achieved the campaign must be conducted with dignity only on the basis of clear cut programs and policies once again our voters will have the option of choosing not their masters but their servants we must in the past prove ourselves a mature people pleased to the processes of democracy and the democratic way of life our people should be enabled to exercise their franchise without fear or hindrance my government will guarantee this the basic birth right of every eligible voter let the free will of the people prevail and all will be well whatever the result this is my firm belief many problems loom large on the horizon we must face them with courage and self confidence some frustrated and desperate elements in our society today are determined to scuttle the principles of our democratic way of life and destroy the very fabric of our secular society while everyone of us is entitled to freedom of expression in appropriate forums no one should be permitted to drag each and every issue to the streets excite dormant passions advocate disrespect for law and order and incite violence such a policy of unwarranted confrontation backed by provocative action on the slightest pretext is a challenge we as citizen of a free country need to face with determination let not a few misguided and disgruntled sections of society imagine that they can hold the rest of us the law abiding citizen to ransom this will not be allowed the post emergency climate has been congenial for reconciling fundamental freedoms and open society with egalitarianism and social justice this is the first republic day with which my 10 month old government is associated let us not judge them hasly stop